large. Large was designed for all the firearms that carry flashlights. Flashlights and lasers. Okay, the first one I'm gonna go with, this is the Olight Mini PL2 on the Glock. And this is a large. So this is the fit you get with it. Nice tight fit. I carry mines like this every day in there. Like I said, this is one of the most popular sizes. I sold out of my first stock within months. Like a, a couple months of having them. So that's the first one we're going to start with. I got a few lights that I got. I got like three lights. This O light and um, night stick. But I'm gonna show you with all the O lights. Next gun will be Canic with the uh, O light. Same thing. So that's the Canic with it. The Taurus G2 24/7. Walter Creed. So Walter Creed with it. Stoger. RP9 One of the older Smith & Wessons It's not going to really work Because it's under the trigger guard So It makes it a, It won't go all the way down So If you got the older one It's not going to work with that You got to have a newer one that doesn't need this adapter to put it on. So that won't work with that. And that's how that gun looks without the adapter. So these are the older ones. The newer ones, you don't have that issue. G3. with the Taurus G3 the FN this is part of my EDC I got other videos you check them out this is you'll see this in my EDC it's not the brown one I got the black one for it I like how the old light set up with that Taurus G2C, perfect fit on there too. Okay, now I'm gonna show you some of the nightstick. I got the 550 XL, which is the smaller one. And I got the 850 XL, which is the big light. I don't have my other bracket on here. I'm gonna just sit it on here just to show you because these plates be interchangeable. So, if this was to lock in like this, it's gonna lock in right there. So I'm gonna just show how that would look inside. That's what you'll get with the knife stick. I got other videos, like I said, with these uh, in there. So I don't have my brackets on, but I'm still gonna show you what they fit. Five fifty is very bright. And that's about as much as you're gonna have exposed. Okay, so that's with the five fifty XL. We 
did the nights we did the Olight. that was a nice stick here's the bigger 850 xl same insert plates if the plate don't match up with it right now i'm gonna just put it on here just so i can show for this video so that's what you get with the glock and with the compensator so everybody don't like the big lights but i'm just giving showing different Plate. examples the 850 is a very bright light that's why i like it okay and that's what you will get with the 850 you got the mag pouch i'm gonna go through some magazines and show you what fits and what probably don't for the tours that's what you're getting out of there all right so this one right here is the smith and wesson 40 cal mag 15 round was that no 14 round still got the room to be able to pull if you try to get a quick release on it here is the Taurus this is the 17 round that came with the G3 with the uh, bloody wheels adapter so you either can take that off or leave it on either or that's the adapter for the G2 but without it that's what you got so next mag will be the Walther Creed, which is a 16 round magazine. This one right here is a single stack magazine for that Chief Special, real slim, but it fits in there good. So it's good for the single stack, all those other ones with double stack. Um, RP9 this is 18 rounds 9 millimeter for the hot point carbines single stack 10 round so you either can rock it for storage or wear it either or a pocket so that was for the carbines that's RP9 again We did that one right there. This is the 15 round one with the bloody wheels. Like I said, you can take that off or if you're carrying it like that, you're still covered. You still can grab it. Carbine, nine millimeter, single stack. For the Canic, 18 round. This is nine millimeter, 16 round, Smith & Wesson. Okay. Little nine millimeter, 10 round mag fits in there. Ten millimeter, single stack, high point carbine mag, 15 round Glock mag. That's what we got with that. So pretty much universal for all the mags besides these will fit, but they're real small. But it's pretty much universal. You can see uh, biggest mag I had was 18. So I was always wondering what people do with these mags. Do they carry them in their pocket or what? So, you know, they make 22s and stuff like that. So these would still fit. Of course, it's hanging out some, but I was always wondering where do people carry these extra mags at? Um, but it does fit in there for people who are looking for a mag pouch that will hold it. So it does fit the 33 rounds and less. So these would be on eBay. Also, Amazon. I have my own website. should be up pretty soon. But for right now, eBay and Amazon.
See your motivation, I see your movement is in effect. And I'm fucking with that shit. <laughs>